Hello everyone, uh, we're going to create a couple of lessons regarding introduction to Canvas games for Android. And in this video we're going to talk about uh, lesson 1, uh, using images with view, surface view in Android. So a couple of words about introduction and general overview. So in this lesson 1 we will be using an image basically that will be displayed in view, surface view Android, using Android Studio. So we will start with activity class, then we will interact with the user, uh, then we will present view class that represent the basic building blocks for the user interface components. So the view will be occupy uh, a rectangular area of the screen and it's responsible for drawing and event handling. So very similar to this class is a surface view that uh, provides uh, more dedicated control to the, to the surface. And we can take care of the place in the surface at the correct location on the screen. So surface view will be a more flexible class to do it. So let's get started. So first of all, uh, we created a basic Android Hello World application. So first things we need to do, we have to delete XML. Because we're not going to use XML in Canvas games. So we just delete activity XML and uh, we can do the save delete and delete it anyway. So in this case, this line will be not valid anymore, right? So because we're not going to connect to activity main XML. Instead of this, we will be connecting to view object. Let's make it name game view class. So we need to create a game view class right now. So we, uh, we will do the following new Java class. And we'll name it game view. And super class for this game view class will be um, a view Android class. Alright, so we get uh, basically a description of this class. We have a message here. Create constructor matching super. So we can do it. And after this looks like the error disappeared. Basically the error disappeared in main activity. And we don't have error in game view. We would like to draw a bitmap in this view, so we will create private uh, bitmap variable. Same BMP. And Android uh, graphics bitmap was added to the uh, important libraries. So in constructor, we need to initialize bitmap. So BMP. So we have to use bitmap factory class my factory class dot decode resource get resources and second argument will be actually the bitmap you would like to display I would like to use the bitmap launcher PNG from the my res bitmap folder so let's try to display this for simplicity so resource r dot map folder and IC launcher. So if, if you notice I didn't uh, type IC launcher, I pick it up from from the list, which is very important. So in this case, resource was identified as described in this line. And now we need to add one method for um, for this view to to draw its content. So the content should be drawn when the activity I'm sorry, when view will be created. So in code section, I will choose override method. And I will search here on draw method. On draw method is displayed here. So just insert override. Okay, so what this method is doing? So by default, this method uh, will be called when view is created and on draw method will just basically draw the content of this view using its canvas. So it's, uh, the canvas is kind of like a blackboard for this view. So let's um, change for example background color for the for this view using canvas. So we will use canvas dot and it has a method draw color and 
and uh, yeah, let's use color class and select the color we want to use. And finally, we need to display bitmap. So the same we're using canvas variable and we will be uh, draw bitmap. So the first argument will be bitmap itself. The second argument will be float left, float top, the position from the left, 10 pixels and 10 positions from the top, and nullable paint, paint, just using now in this case. So we're done with basic setup for the game view. So let's uh, run the project. All right, so we received basically uh, application with uh, with the game view that has uh, a single bitmap elements position 10 10 and uh, yeah and uh, the color for the background is blue so to update the project we um, uh, we will be uh, updating uh, game view as extends for the surface view because we want complete control over the screen so we will use in uh, class surface view so um, this required a little bit modification additionally to this we will create a variable that will be controlling the surface of this uh, view and that this class has a name surface holder holder variable holder after this we have to add uh, some callback method for the holder so how to do it we will be using holder variable and method add callback this parameter will be new surface holder dot callback that's very important to get this type correctly because we will be using help of this red bulb. So when you use implement method and press this, you will be adding three more method surface created, surface changed and surface destroyed. Press OK. So in this case we uh, implemented holder and uh, added uh, three method to overwrite. Method one, surface created method 2 surface changed and method 3 surface destroyed basically this uh, callback method will be called by the system it's easy to understand that uh, surface created will be called when the current game view surface is available so we want to do something when surface is created right so what we want to do here we want to uh, lock the canvas so locking the canvas will help us uh, to lock the canvas that nobody can use canvas in the moment when uh, we will be using canvas so the canvas will be just simply locked by holder so holder but lock canvas semicolon then we will be calling this uh, on draw method with the canvas and when this finished the holder will be unlocked holder dot unlock and post yeah looks like we are done so what the line is here let's just disable inspection okay so let's uh, change right now position for the bitmap uh, 200 by 200 position and uh, run the project so we received uh, updated picture so we see the object is moved and basically yeah that's what we how the project looks like when we update view to the surface view we add surface holder and three method to controlling uh, the screen and we just only uh, update surface created method so it was a video how to uh, create lesson one, how to display uh, 
bitmap in the screen using Surface View class. So please finish these instructions, add the modifications according to the instructions and show your demo at the end of the class. Thanks and have a good day.